Good morning everyone and welcome back to the Two-Headed Wolf Hammer as we're continuing our tournament in Blood Bowl 3 in the Pirate Crew competition. So let's get this started, we're actually fighting some welcome sailors now. Back, Blood Bowl. I like how this whole thing looks. Are we actually fighting dwarves? I'm going to imagine that they are slow, but they are really tough. Maybe they will be really tough to be pushed back or something. Is this like the old world alliance? Because I see humans and dwarves. So. Weather. Shame. Nothing to spice things up. The stubborn sailors. Okay, so preparations. What do we want from this? The wandering apothecary could be useful. We have a bit more money, temporary agency, cheerleaders. Each cheerleader brings a bonus on a certain kickoff event result, such as cheering fans. I think I should try probably some of these one at a time. Grants your team, you a team reroll for each half of the match. But it is expensive. Their cost 105, 140. You know what? I'll keep some of the money here. Maybe I'll just buy. No, I'll not buy anything. Let's just get this started. Being alive is a roll of the dice. You never know what you're going to throw. Being undead is like. Blessed Statue of Nuffle. One of your players without the Lorna trade gets a drive. Okay, sure. Who will get the skill? Ah, I see. So you have only a limited amount of time to pick who gets that boon. And you can pick it for your player. Okay, there's a lot more that I need to learn. Greasy cleats. Receive the ball or kick the ball? Let's receive the ball. Here we go, Jim. Here we go. I have to look through the menu. There might be a situation here. Let's do this. There might be the case somewhere around here that I can stop those timers from going off because I don't have enough speed to read through them. Yeah, I like this. Let's get it started. Nice for the team. A noble player on the receiving team can be placed on the square where the ball will land. High kick. Ah, okay. There we go. So how do we plan things out? They have... This guy's a runner. What abilities does he have? Pick Skull on an injury test against this player. Okay. So it takes a lot more to stun him. Sure hands and a loner. Any other traits that we've never seen before? Something around here. Armbar. If an opponent marked by at least one player with this skill fails a dodge, leap or jump over test, plus one is applied to armor value or injury test. Is a brawler on a block declaration but not on a blitz. This player can reroll on both down results. I see. And this one, a troll slayer, dauntless. When this player attempts a block or a blitz on a target whose strength is higher than his own before, okay, a d6 result is added to the strength of this player. If the total is superior to the player's strength, the strength of the player is increased to be equal to that of the target. Frenzy. Okay, so dwarves are loner, but other than that, they are really strong. Let's engage. At the moment, I'm just going to engage here. Hmm.
No, I do not want you to throw it. Let me see if I can maybe block some of you. Yeah, we'll go here. We'll do a roll. Both down. Let's do a re-roll. Oof. That is really bad. Should have advanced. This will be a turnover. Choose injury. KO. Yeah. So we're starting with a turnover. That's not great for us. Ooh, he managed to dodge a bunch of attacks here. Today. His dwarf didn't do. Okay. Surrounded by adversaries like that. I hope he knows what he's doing. Let's see. Okay, we'll push you back. And we'll follow through. That will allow this guy to go forward. With you, what I will want to do is that I want you to push this line. Good. We'll do some assists here. Defender stumbles, great. So we're following through and pushing him down. It's gonna be tough, so. I'm not thinking of too many advantages over here, but I'll force a line on this side. Let's see, can I push you? You are marked, so you won't have a huge advantage over there. We will have one of you stay around this area and hold him down. I am thinking about pushing him into the crowd during the next turn. Good. Now at this moment I can try to rush here. Not bad. And the final thing that I'll do is that I'll try to push him. Both down. We'll accept this one. But since he's a defender, we're totally fine. And I feel like that's pretty much it. Let's end the turn. Can I speed this up? Let's see. Game. Cinematics. Always. Action wheel. Position. Facing camera. Hide. Nope. At least I don't see any. Above and Ooh. At the same time. Yeah, that was that was an ugly hit, but we should be able to get up during the next turn. We should be able to recreate the line somewhere over here. Fast and impossible to tackle. Oof. Ooh. We just lost the ball here. He escaped us here. And he's trying to bring in some support. And they've made quite a really good block here, but... He is down. Let me see. So that's a... Minus four. Yeah, there's quite a bit to do here. He 
you. Jump over, move, let's stand up. Okay, now you are able to do something. I will stand you up as well. I will bring you over here. And we'll work on taking you down. Right, we'll push you back, we'll do this, we'll follow through. Then I am going to bring another player over here. The attacker has an assist. Nice, defender stumbles, we'll push him back, we'll follow through. Beautiful work. That is a bad assist, so we'll need to block him. What I'll do is that I'll bring you here. This will be, player will be marked. We'll take this guy. Yeah, not a huge advantage over there. I am thinking about doing a fall here. Okay, managed to do it for the moment, but we didn't really take him out in any way. Let's see, where do I want to push this line? Probably over here, this is as far as I want to rush. Oof, now we'll re-roll. I can't see a sign saying slippery surface at the edge of the pitch. Eesh. Badly hurt. Let's use the apothecary. We can't remove another player from the pitch at the moment. No injury. Okay. That player should punch the other enemy players quickly before trying anything else. This play didn't turn out as I wanted it to. Can't argue with that. Can you? What do we want? Pow or defenders? Pow, definitely. Oh no. Oh, that's the effect that I wanted to have. <laughs> I am not doing great at this, am I? Coach is asking a lot of this player. Maybe I should try. Some of you recommended that I should try. Blood Bowl 2, maybe I should do that, maybe I can understand it better. I'll give it at least a go to begin with and then we'll see how it turns out. So what do I do here? First of all, let's move you forward, right? We'll move him forward and that leaves us some space to do something. Yeah, we'll push you over... Here. And we'll follow through. Good. Then I can move you over here. Defender stumbles and we'll push you in that direction. And we'll follow through. Beautiful stuff. Your player fails, it's catch test, okay. Yeah, it's fine if he drops the ball. Ah! Required this 6 plus. No, let's fail. So this is how the ball got moved from one player to the other, I see. Okay, interesting. I need a 3 plus dodge. And a 5 plus to pick it up. You know what? We'll try it. Come on. Good, finally. We've got a pick up here. Now what do I want to do? We can have a really good assist here. Let's push you back. 
like so. And I'll want to follow through. Nice. You will do this. Ah. Attacker down, very unfortunate. And we got a turnover. I have a little support, but not a whole lot. What a bunch of incompetent gits. If I had my way, I'd flog them all. That's it. Get in their face. Ooh. Ooh, this is going to be rough. Unity is strength. A good coach always uses the right player, right job. Ooh. <laughs> I can feel the, the advantage that they have. It's a bit unfortunate, but what can you do? Let's get up. For right now. I really want to push him back. Can I push you back? Yeah. Well, we have some assists. Let's see. Nice pow. We'll move him over there and you stay put. Perfect. So, like this, we've just freed one of them. Too many dodges for that. You get up, please. We'll try to make some sort of an advance here. Let's push him back in the back. Good. What are the chances that you will catch? You are a human lineman, you are a blitzer. So if I want to go this in this direction, we will have to roll some of these. If I bring you here, I could attack this one. Okay, we didn't actually manage to do anything. I have to move this and quick. Okay, let's go like this. You try to get over there with a few rolls. Ah. With us today to commentate on this match. I warn you, I won't answer any questions about my company finances or the Yeah, two minutes for end of turn. There's so much that I need to, to figure out here in this short amount of time. My strategizing is very slow right now. That's a good choice for this play. Hmm. But I love it. I have to say that so far as I don't know why I didn't play this game earlier. I should have played this game earlier, but I just didn't know that I would enjoy it this much. And I think I'm going to bring Blood Bowl to at some point in the near future and actually play that until they fix a bit more of this because I've seen the developers have put out a a message that they are going to keep working on it to improve some of the stuff that the community expected and you know they're committed to to making this a or at least they are committed to put out a good PR message. Sure, let's try to knock them down. Defender stumbles over there. We'll do something like this and we'll follow through. Beautiful. Okay, he is stunned. A 
We'll do a pow, we'll push him over there. And I guess on this occasion I'll follow through. And at this point I'm just gonna jump in. Ah! Failed a dodge roll there. And we got another injury. Our sidelines still look too great. In comparison to theirs. Now I'm hoping that this dwarf will stumble. But they have a slight numerical advantage over here. So they use the blitz. What he could do free here, he could try to throw. They're going to spend time on the bench. They zap. Okay. Good. So many fails. What is this? A blind halflings match or something? Is there something that I need to do here? Or why am I stuck? I don't know, but for some reason I'm stuck. Let's see. Leaving a match before it ends means conceding it. Uh, nope. Ah, okay. So now we're, we are able to move again. Good. Well, what I'll do for now will just try to take you down. Nice. A nice bow. And I'll push you over there and follow through. Beautiful. That player's a little short. No, my mistake. He's on the ground. Okay, then what I'll do here is that I'll activate this blades. This could be a sack. <laughs> I love it when that happens. Just to push through. Let's push him there and then push the other one over there. Because this at least will bring you in line to attack over here. Not ideal, but we'll do this one as well. Let's see. A nice assist over there, so let's see if we can take some of you out and follow through. I mean, we really need to reduce some of their teams. Attack her down, very unfortunate. And we got a stun there as well. I've seen some bad Blood Bowl matches in my time, and this is one of them. The commentators are not happy with what's going on right now. No touchdowns so far. Ah, I see. So this is this is how many movements or how many turns we still have left until the end of the round. Ooh. <laughs> they are really doing a number on our team. We are doing a number on their team as well, but still. Oh, I can't believe this. So many fails. What is this? A blind halflings match or something? Look, look at our team, mostly on the ground here. Okay, very little chance of doing something super strong. So 
so we'll just have to work on this. Yeah, I'll follow through here. And we've, with what we've just deliberated... Defender stumbles, we'll push him back over there. And we'll follow through. Why not? If I had a gold crown for every player, and I think that's bit that's well, all of what we can do. Team. You only need a million gold, right? He might uh, the the way that he can go forward here, he might just throw a pass right to one of his other players and they can then run into the dodge down. Or he can escape us here. Now his body can move freely. He's sprinting. Let's hope it's going to be okay. One less annoyance to deal with. Wow. How are they going to catch or run with a ball that they're constantly writhing around on the ground? Oh dear! Is that a good Oof. tackle or a bad dodge? End of the first half. Crack and I. Any advice for the coach of the opposing team? Have a good breather, because they'll be in deep water in the second half. Okay, so we'll have some of our people back, but not We've all of them. Refreshment. Oh, I we have two badly injured and one out, and they have their full teams. Oof. Well, good luck to us. We can kick it. Let's kick it over here. Both of these teams are on the edge. This kick is crucial. Brilliant coaching. Yes, they picked up the ball. Whoopie dee dee. Now, if he wants to advance, there will be a few rolls, but he's probably going to try to, to make some sort of a defensive line somewhere around here. I should really be working on taking some of these down. I think they're trying to box him in again. And bring this one over here. Oh, bring that one over there. Okay, at least I'm starting to figure out what they're trying to do. It feels like I'm playing Total War Warhammer, where the dwarves are making their box defenses. Nice. So he's down. Let's bring you here. I'll tie you up with this one. We'll get you in here. Yes, I'll get this guy in here. This guy in here. Both down, you do not have a defender, so I'll just have to push him back. At this moment and follow through yeah let's follow through leave a gap open but hopefully he will not be able to hold it and then I'll bring you on this side and that's going to be it for my turn I'll leave these two behind for now what will they do Hmm. Any of them? This is a blitzer, and these are linemen. Na none of them is a catcher. 
It's interesting what they're trying at least to do. Maybe they're thinking about numerical advantage. Good. Oh, he dropped the ball there, so it's a turnover now. Who is free? You are a catcher. Okay, first of all, you. This is going to be decisive. Nice. We'll do a nice pow here, over there, and follow through. Beautiful. On the floor again. This team you like pick up the ball. Quick and easy. Nothing to see here. And then how far can we get? You can get up to here. So what I'll do is that I'll do this. That player can move over a third of the field in one burst of speed. God, that's fast. A nice roll, give me something good. Defender stumbles, great. And I'll throw him over there in that corner and we'll follow through. A prone player is a Which dead. means that I can bring another one. Another player over on this side with you. Let's see. It's only a plus one there. Let's get stuck here. While also getting stuck here. That is a really nice assist. Defender stumbles. Great. Let's push him there. Follow up. Which pretty much means that this one is free to get in the range of this dwarf. Who's a blocker. He's really strong, but... What I am hoping is that he'll have two dodge rolls that he'll have to pass before he can get here and do some sort of a blitz action. This one will not be able he, this ones will be able to assist, but they will not be able to do any kind of actions. It really depends on a few rolls what's happening, but we'll see. Like that one. That is a fail on his part, so we have the advantage. It is a turnover too. So touchdown! Let's go, let's go! Ooh! Good, let's go, let's go. I will accept. End the turn. Let's get this going. And we'll kick it off. I'll try once again to do the same sort of idea. I'll kick it in this side. Solid defense. D3 plus 3 open players on the kicking team are removed and placed in different locations following the usual setup rules. Okay. The ball didn't go exactly. So open player can be removed and placed in different locations. Are these open players? Or I can choose them and then say continue and they'll be placed. Let's pick these two and say continue. What happens? I see. So I can place them somewhere where I feel like they'll be at a better advantage of probably intercepting that, right? Right. There we go. But now let's see what they plan to do. The team have possession. Hmm. This is not bad because the left flank now is fully opened. If they surround him here, then why would you want to surround him? Making this sort of a box gives you a bit more options than if you fully surround him because then he can't move, right? At least that's what I'm thinking at this point. Good rolls on his side. Okay, let's see. Let's try to make this happen. In a way that makes sense. I will bring you forward here. That should mean... That I could bring you forward here. Which would mean that at this point I could follow through. 
Defender stumbles and will push him over there and will follow up. Nice, and we also stunned him. That at least means that at this moment we should move him back over here and follow through. Which pretty much leaves you open, even though you are fully marked. Let's see, let's mark another player as well. Right, we do pretty much the same and this leaves us... With what? I will bring you here, I will bring you up here. And we'll bring you on this side. That could be a good injury there. Let's try a foul play. Didn't succeed. But that's it for our turn. Let's see what's going to happen now. If they were a catch, I guess... When can you throw the ball? Can you throw the ball at any point? Like, could he throw the ball from here on out? Or maybe because he has a few linemen in, then that might be a problem. Oof. Ooh. He seems a little stunned, doesn't he? Okay. All over the place. I can't see them going much further with players. So far so good, let's see. How do I do this? I will get you up. So that I could get some assists, right? I am going to get stand you up. And bring you in this area, right? Which they've got the advantage, but there is no sure both thing. down. Yeah, he will not be down in this situation. We can do that, and I'll have you sit still. We'll try to force an attack on you. A nice pow there. And let's see if we can do something with that. If he drops the ball here. Oh no, my mistake. He's on the ground. Any foul play here? A nice KO. You. Let's do a nice assist here and. Defender stumbles. I do like that. We'll follow through. If I had a gold crown for every player I've seen lying on the field during my career, well, I could start my own team. You only need a million gold, right? Now, what am I going to do here? I feel like I should be moving up here. Right, to hold down that line. And with you, I'll move here. And that is going to be my turn for now. Didn't use the blaze, probably should have used it. But in this situation, I feel like we've made good progress. They still have a lot of potential for taking us down. But at the end of the day, I don't think that they can do it in one turn. At least not at the moment. Oof. He made some space. But he can't move. Okay, he's getting more and more enraged. Now he's blitzing with his dwarf here. That player better get up. Nothing good comes from spending any time on the ground in this game. The player makes this. They should get a pay rise. Good. A nice fall there. And we have a turnover. So that means that I'll get you up. Oof. 
Stand you up. Are you free? You are not free at the moment. We have some good assists here, so I'll do a pow. And then throw you in that direction and... Yeah, we'll follow through. Good, so he fell again, but dwarves are really, really strong in this situation. Let's try to do another one of these. Defender stumbles, yeah, we'll throw him there, we'll do the follow-up. I feel like maybe that's where I should be mostly rolling my my injuries, right? Trying to get the humans off the battlefield. Sorry, the playing field. What do we have here? That is too strong. But we'll try it. Sure, we'll push you back. And back, and back, and back. And we'll even follow through. Good. Let me bring you around to support. And pretty much do the same over here. So we're surrounding them more than anything by Phil. And I'm not sure exactly what would be the escape here. Probably having a few good rolls that could knock him down. Either way, we are now touching him, right, with this one. That'll do, player. That'll do. Turnover. Turnover, great. Ooh. Oh, I feel like this is going to be good. So let's see. These are linemen. Do we have a blitzer anywhere nearby? No, we do not. Well, I almost feel like I know what I have to do going forward now. I will go like this. We have only one more round in order to succeed here. So let's see. We'll attack you. And we'll follow through. This frees this guy up, so I could go and defend this area with you. Yeah, everything over here is very well marked by him. Let's push back, follow through, you. Another pushback. Yeah, we'll push you over there and follow through. At first I thought that two minutes is so much time that you really don't have anything to do in that time, but it's not really that much time. Now that's a Nice, badly hurt. So we took another one off the field. They're going to be carrying that scar around for the rest of their short life. Another one of these stuns. And we'll follow through. Get up or get off the field. Okay. And we'll do another roll here with falling down. Okay. Let's see, we have one more turn, so I'm hoping that we'll be able to score a touchdown on that turn, but whether we manage to succeed here or not, I do not know. Nicely done. Ooh. Oh, that looks painful. Come on. There we go. 
And another one bites the dust here. Hip hip hooray, hip hip hooray. Match finished, return to the main menu. Great. So there we have it. The next match will be against the Black Art Corsairs. This is going to have to be it for today. I hope you have enjoyed it. I am starting to understand this better and better, which is really cool. I'm enjoying this one a lot. And I am looking forward to trying it out again and maybe try a few more games, probably in... Maybe in Blood Bowl 2? You let me know what you want to see. Do you want to see Blood Bowl 2 or Blood Bowl 3? What, which one should I try or continue to play? What do you want to see more? Do you want to see the new game? Do you want to see the old game more? I don't know. I really don't know what to do, but I am enjoying the experience for right now. If you did enjoy this match, do you consider leaving a like on the video? It would be much appreciated that it does help me, helps the channel grow. And until next time, I thank you very much for watching and I wish you all to have a wonderful day.